Greetings friends, today with us we have Muhammad Abdul Muhib Advocate from the Chamber of Advocates in front of High Court of Telangana. We have a small question for you. Uh, law students come for internships and sometimes uh, they say that the advocates teach them nicely and sometimes the advocates take small works from them which are not related to law like lifting the files from one place and dumping it in another place or parking their car etc random works which are no way related to law so ab about this what is uh, your feedback so thank you very much for calling me today here and asking me this very very crucial question about internship as you have asked even students of mine who are working as interns in the very beginning they when they when they gave their applications for internship many of the advocates asked them to do clerical jobs in the very beginning like for example they are uh, they are being asked to post the notices second post the notices now they are, they have been asked to park the vehicles in the court uh, parking areas and bring the files and take the files and stand behind them or whenever they are traveling in the whenever they are traveling take the notices take the all the paperwork and when they're in the court when they are in the court premises they are being asked to carry all the files and walk behind them this is one of the trend we see when we go to various high courts various uh, courts such as high court even in the lower courts district court civil court so one of the question which have been which is very common when the new student is enrolling into llb when they see all these uh, frames seeing that the junior advocates or the fresh advocates are being compelled to do clerical jobs they ask me this question is the work of an advocate now i would like to clear this rumor that when a student of llb applies to an internship he might be studying the law subject he doesn't know the practical work the actual work of an intern is to assist the advocate rather than become a servant the assistance is complete should be completely in the form of legal work for example drafting and a senior advocate or an any advocate under whom the internship is, is being done he should guide the interns in such a way that they become good advocates and they should know the practical work as this is the object of internship is to make aware an llb student what they should be doing when they complete their llb for example drafting of notices drafting of petitions drafting of affidavits and doing every work which is law related now this question which have been posed by our fellow mate is that they are doing clerical work this is absolutely wrong i don't say that all the advocates do all these things but some of the advocates who don't want to teach but they want some people they want some juniors to carry their papers to for show off i would say and they by the by that they show that they themselves want to show themselves as a very senior very senior counsel so when once you go to an advocate ask them to teach them the work now why why these people are compelled we have to remember that i would like to give some guidelines or give some tips to the junior advocates before going to apply for internship the very first requirement for an internship is to find a good advocate you just apply for 10 advocates and find out whether he is really going to teach you or not second you should be knowing very basic minimum typing skills second you should be knowing what is drafting what do we do and majorly people or the students who know typing who know typing plus ms word ms office experience ms office knowledge 
they would be far better positioned to work as an intern rather than just doing clerical works. Even the advocates are being compelled. They take the intern without uh, understanding the skill set of the internees. And once they are hired, they come to know that they are unable to use the computers, unable to do the computer work or MS office work. So by this, the, the as they can't fire them, they just they just ask to do the compelled work. And after some 21 days, the mandatory requirement for any student to do internship, they give the certificate and they just relieve them of their works. The thing is, the very first thing the student needs to know is to have a skill set, develop a skill set. First skill is typing work. Second skill is MS Office, MS Word, MS Excel sometimes and MS PowerPoints for making the presentations. Majorly the work is, the work will be in the MS Word only, Microsoft Word, where we need to, uh, where we need to draft the notices, affidavits, petitions, Whatever it is being required has to be done in MS Word itself. Now, once a student has an MS skill set of typing plus MS Office expertise, the senior advocate or any advocate under whom the internship is being done, they will give the work automatically. And by this, they would not only get the knowledge of practical advocacy, but also they would ask the internees to visit the courts. Now, what they do, they, they do in the court, they have to go to